Hello everybody, it's Wolf Productions once again. Welcome back to another video, and welcome back to another Christmas review. So, this is my bonus Christmas review. Yep, this is my bonus Christmas review. So, today, I'm, I'm going to be doing a review on Jack Frost from 1979 by Rankin Bass. I absolutely love this movie when I was a kid. I really loved this Rankin Bass movie when I was a kid, you guys. And it's just, this Christmas movie is such a big, huge part of my childhood. And I just love this Rankin Bass special so much. So, yeah, you guys. So, this is my bonus Christmas review. So, yeah, you guys. So, yeah, I'll be doing... A, I'll be doing a review on Jack Frost from 1979. I'm still... Even this, even this is 2024, um, I'm still gonna put this movie on my playlist for my Christmas reviews of 2023, so, yeah, yeah, just to keep you guys updated, so, even if, even, um, so, <clears throat> start for starting, um, even, um, even it's 2024, I'm still gonna put this I'm still going to put my uh, bonus Christmas review of Jack Frost, and I'm still going to put my review on my Christmas reviews of 2023. So, yeah, you guys. Um, But anyways, today I'll be doing a review on Jack Frost from 1979. So, without being said, let's get straight into this review. So, hello, everybody. It's Will Productions once again. Today I'll be doing... A review on Jack Frost. Kim of the Year of 1979. So, let's go ahead and get to the plot. So, basically, what the plot is... The Groundhog tells the story of how, for once, Jack Frost became a human and helped a knight win his lady love. And that is basically what the plot is. What can I think of this Christmas movie slash Rankin Bass movie? I really, really love this Christmas movie so much. This Christmas movie is such a big, huge part of my childhood. I really love this movie so much when I was a kid. And when it comes to Rankin Bass, I really love Rankin Bass movies. I really love Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer from 1964. Which, which is my favorite Rankin Bass movie, and and my other favorite Rankin Bass movie is Frosty the Snowman, which I really enjoyed, and I also enjoyed Frosty's Winter Wonderland, and I also really enjoyed um Rudolph and Frosty's Christmas in July, and I also I also really enjoyed um Santa Claus is Coming to Town and A Year Without a Santa Claus and. And I also do really love The Little Drummer Boy and and some other things. And there is one Rankin Bass movie that I'm going to be doing a review on it on Easter. And I'll be doing a review on Here's Co Here Comes Peter Cottontail, which which is a Easter Rankin Bass movie. Which I'll be doing a review on Here Comes Peter Cottontail coming in April on Easter. So stay tuned. Yeah, I really love Breaking Bass movies so much. Breaking Bass movies are, are a big, huge part of my childhood. So, let's go ahead and get to the characters, shall we? We have um Jack Frost himself, which Jack Frost is such a good character. And, and of course, we also have the Groundhog who narrates the story. And, um, and we also have, um, an, um, and we also have, let me see. And we also have the villain, which I really, really love the villain. And and um, uh, what? Uh, I also do really love the rest of the characters. All the rest of the characters are are really, really wonderful. And the villain is amazing. I really love the villain in this movie. The villain is amazing. And yeah, just the rest of the characters are pretty nice. And 
This Christmas movie is such a big, huge part of my childhood. I absolutely enjoyed this Christmas movie slash Rankin Bass movie. And, and yes, you guys, I'll be doing a review on Here Comes Pierre Cottontail, which, which is a Easter Rankin Bass movie, which I'll be doing a review on Here Comes Pierre Cottontail coming in, coming in April. So, yeah, you guys, um... But I really enjoyed this movie. This Christmas movie is such a big, huge part of my childhood. Yeah, I really love Jeff Frost from 1979. It's such an enjoyable movie that I really enjoyed. So, yeah. I also do really love the animation of this movie. The animation is pretty nice. I, I, yeah. Um... I really love the animation for this movie, even though it's stop motion, but I really love the animation in this movie. It's so amazing. And I also do really love the stop, and yes, I really love the animation slash stop motion thing, which that is pretty nice, like they did in some Rake and Bass movies, like Rudolph the red Reindeer and Santa Claus is Coming to Town and stuff, and... No, and I oh, and I can't forget another Rankin Bass movie that I really enjoyed, which is Rudolph's Shiny New Year. Which I did a review on Rudolph's Shiny New Year on New Year's Eve of 2023. So yeah, but I really enjoyed Jack Frost from 1979. I really enjoyed this movie so much. Um, yeah, this movie is such a big, huge part of my childhood, and. Yeah, just this Rankin Bass movie is such a wonderful movie, and yeah, I I do really love the stop motion animation like they did, like they did in, like they did in Rudolph the red Reindeer, Santa Claus is Coming to Town, and A Year Without Santa Claus, and the, and the Little Drummer Boy, so yeah, um, yeah, Jack Frost from 1979 is a pretty good Christmas movie for the whole family, and this Christmas movie is such a big, huge part of my childhood, so, yeah, you guys, um, speaking of Christmas reviews, sadly, I was supposed to do a review on a Christmas store, a re, a re-review on a Christmas story, and I was, I was, I was sorry for starting, and I, and I also was supposed to do a review on It's a Wonderful Life and, and Miracle on 34th Street, the classic movie in the 1994 remake. But sadly, I didn't ha I didn't have time to do a review on those Christmas movies. But don't worry, you guys. I'm going to be doing a review on those Christmas movies for my Christmas reviews of 2024. So yeah, you guys. Um, But... Yeah, Jack Frost is a pretty good movie. I recommend you watch this Rankin Bass movie. So, yeah. Yeah. It's a pretty good movie. I really enjoyed this movie so much. And I do really love how the groundhog narrates this, narrates this movie, which that is pretty nice. Um, Yeah, Jack Frost is a pretty good Rankin Bass movie. And there's some other Rankin Bass movies like that I enjoyed. I enjoyed Rudolph and Frosty's Christmas in July, which is... Which I haven't seen that film when I was a kid until I watched it last year, so yeah. And um I also and there are some other Rankin Fast movies that I watched when I was a kid. Um I did watch Rudolph Arendos Reindeer, Frosty the Snowman, some other films. And I think I haven't watched Here Comes Peter Cottontail, which I'll be watching that movie in April, um, during Easter, so yeah, you guys, and I'll be doing a review on Here Comes pa Here Comes Peter Cottontail coming in Easter, so yeah, you guys, stay tuned, coming in Easter, so, yeah, I really enjoyed Jack Frost, pretty good Rankin Bass movie, so, anyways, I got nothing else to say, so, I hope you guys enjoyed this bonus Christmas review so far, make sure to smash that like button, share it to others, comment down below, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And no, Christmas reviews are not coming to an end. Because I was supposed to do I was supposed to do a review uh, a review on It's a Wonderful Life and Miracle on 34th Street, the classic movie in the 1994 remake, and I was and I was supposed to do a re-review on a Christmas story, but unfortunately I didn't have time, so I decided to review on those Christmas movies coming 
coming in my Christmas reviews of 2024, so yeah, you guys, um, anyways, um, Christmas reviews are not coming to an end, which I'll be doing a review, uh, uh, yeah, Christmas reviews are not coming to an end, which I'll be doing a review on It's a Wonderful Life, Miracle on, 30, uh, on 34th Street, the classic movie, and the 1994 remake, and a Christmas Story, which I'll be, re I'll be reviewing those movies for my Christmas reviews coming in 2024, so yeah. Anyways, you guys, I got nothing else to say, so hope you guys enjoyed this bonus Christmas review so far. Make sure to smash that like button, share it to others, comment down below, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching, and goodbye.